During the post-election violence of 2007, we found that it required a rethinking of approaches and mechanisms to stop the violence and to engage the country in its new constitutional reform process. Through all of our teams, the mission engaged in, di in a broad dialogue in order to ensure that the people's voice was heard. Accountability and governance. It's so important for the agency and it is a really top priority for us in Indonesia. And we've had the chance to talk with over a thousand Indonesians across the country. And what they've told us is their top concerns are good governance and fighting rampant corruption. And as Indonesia has decentralized, rampant corruption has decentralized as well. Human rights for lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, and intersex LGBTI people is still difficult for many Malawians to talk about. We are integrating our programs in three focus districts, making sure that the issues facing persons with disabilities and the LGBTI community are included. In addition to health, economic growth, and education objectives, we have added a deal that helps citizens demand the services they need and hold their leaders accountable for those services. USAID Malawi is approaching these challenges from a human rights perspective to protect vulnerable groups and advocate for their fair treatment by law and in practice. We try to keep the communication channels open to discuss the issue with the belief that change is happening. Integration for governance is really important, ensuring the sustainability of our programs and also strengthening our partner institutions so that they're able to continue these programs well after we leave Nepal or well after those programs end. Mm -hmm.